Up Close and Gaming presents Fallout. To me, Fallout is about the exploration, and also the combat, as well as the background stories or quests. But 90% of the time, I'm at the settlement playing sewer skylines with my settlers, so I don't get out much. Okay. But one day, when I was out looking for junk to turn into beds for my settlers, I found mystery keeps me up to this day. Nice. Adrian, Carl, got a job you might be interested in. We still need a sniper, even split of the loot. You up for it? If so, you know where to find me. Something just seemed off. What would compel a man to leave his home? His weapon, just to go downstairs and be eaten alive by roaches. I had to get to the bottom of it. But it would be a long journey. And during it, tragedy struck. I lost a dear friend. But you know, sometimes life goes on. And you find something that makes the load a little bit easier to bear. That's nice. My new friend was so much better than my old friend. This friend could walk into a pistol and do nothing. This thing could also have the delicacy to pick apart something that all the dexterity in the world is required. Like picking locks and hacking terminals. This friend could walk into a group of goals and feel nothing. Whoa, there's too many. Get him out of here. You're not killing anyone. I was even able to use a special move that I put in retirement. But alas, I had been distracted from my true purpose. And it was time I got what I came here for. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plains. Within the walls, you, our descendants, will find the items and treasure in the year 2077. But then again, maybe some things ain't better known for what's left without some mystery in the world. I went back to my settlement. A different man, but the same man. I imagine there's not many to view these items as treasure anymore these days. Can't imagine. <laughs> 